Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new video and in this video I don't want to be having a little wonder around the town area So I don't know what happened there but as you can tell the ambulance were going up Tarbot Road The tram is now open to the public and they're paying the public and things now so just on Abington Street now, and as you can tell, there's a couple of shops and things on here. You got like um, a cash trader there. What do you like? Your phones and things. You got a barbers, and you got like a fashion type um, shop there. What sell ladies and men were. Then you got the one and only famous Abington Barbecue. Now that is like a really nice type of sandwich shop. If you want all your different types of meat and things. You've got like your amusement and things, some lions, and um, a charity shop. <laughs> got the Royal Mail old building just right here with the red foam boxes on the outside. Then you also got the Abbey Street uh, Market just right next to it. That's like a food court now. You don't get like your market stalls and things no more in there. It's all about your food. And also the Abbey Street Market used to be an old police station. Not every day you get followed by a seagull. <laughs> Just at the side of Hound Hill now. And as you can tell, it is quite quiet town. But I don't to um, just have a little wonder to the McDonald's and then have a um, little wonder on the prom. See what is happening on the prom. Starbucks looking more on the quiet side. But I suppose when the sun and things out, people want more cold type drinks than hot drinks. And here we got the greedy pig, and then it's looking for full and part time staff. So you wish on the Blackpool area looking for a job this season, then maybe try a look at the greedy pig in the town centre. So here we got the Blackpool Dungeons, 252 special effects, 10 live action shows and one extreme exciting ride and 60 minutes experience. And here we got the old sports direct, we're not going to be taking it place as it is quite a huge unit to be taking on. And of course we have got the new attraction in Blackpool, the Saw Town. Have anyone been in it yet? Or are you coming um, coming to Blackpool and planning to come here in the season? But I don't know if the prices have changed or anything, but I know it was free for Blackpool registrants. So you did live in Blackpool and you wanted a little trip or something, then maybe give it a look. I'll put the website down in down below in the description so you can check it out for yourself and it looked like Collar Island still getting a bit of work done to it don't know what happened there and this is something you don't see every day look at that ball car so as you can tell we got the sea out and we got a lot of beach to work with um, this evening. You've got people out building sandcastles, you've got a couple of people just having a nice relaxing walk and just enjoying the scenery. And even on the top bit of the prom you've got people riding bikes, you've got people just enjoying this nice weather what we've been having so far this week. Hopefully it keeps up and we don't get a bit of rain for a little while. Even so, the rain is good for nature and the wildlife and things, but sometimes it's nice to get that nice 
breeze with the sun that what we're getting today it's not too hot but it's not too cold you've got a couple of people over there playing with football and things and now i am coming up to the tourist hotspot well the comedy car pass people know it but if you've been to blackpool before and things you know a lot of people come to this carpet to get the picture in front of the famous blackpool tower what just literally right there that like, like the main attraction of blackpool ain't it and of course you've got your free piers and things what get busy in the season definitely central pier but you've got a couple of rides and things I can't really comment on South Pier because I don't really go that way that often. But I suppose, but you that will get busy also because you got the gym bar on there. A couple of rides and things. And then um, North Pier, just mainly for people who just want to have a drink. And it looks like we have got a bit of work happening just on the lights here. We've got the Blackpool Council and things out. So it's in changing the lights, so um, sorting them out, ready for the Christmas ones to be put up. Right then guys, that don't be the end of that video. If you did enjoy this type of video, then please give it a like. If you want to see any more videos like this one, then hit the subscribe button. If you don't want to miss any upcoming videos, then please turn on the notification bell. I'll see you on the next one.